Hello Tech Savvy Agent fans, it's Steve Passanelli and I'm excited to be here today with Max Pigman, Vice President of Realtor.com. How you doing Max? I'm doing excellent Steve, uh, we're happy to be here as well. Yeah, well we have some exciting news to share for the real estate community about a brand new application that's going to be released at Inman Connect San Francisco this week. This is the biggest one of the biggest debuts, I think, of a, of a mobile application that we've ever had since since we came out with one, right? You know, I think this is, Steve, kind of the game-changing part of our application development. The first application had a lot of wow factor. It was very simple, very easy to use. People loved the functionality built into it. But from an agent perspective, the agents just kind of felt like, well, that's kind of nice for the consumer. And yeah, there's some information in there that I find helpful, but I really can't see how I could utilize that app in my business. And that's a challenge that we've had. And and that's where this changes all of that, because this is finally a an agent, an agent branded version of the same great Realtor.com app that everyone loves, but removing some information and adding some key functionality, right? Yeah, number one request we were getting from agents was, hey, I want to get my branding on your app. I realize that you have one of the most powerful apps, the most accurate data, but how can I utilize that with my customers? How can I get them a version of your app which has my contact information yeah. prominently displayed at all times? And that's what this new version uh, of the app is going to do. And the great thing is the price is, is right. It's, <laughs> it's free. <laughs> it's free. So, so let's do a quick walkthrough from the agent side. And as you can see on the screen, the iPad would be the agent side of the application. And after you go through a short sign up process, very simple and easy to do when you first log in, you provide some details. Now you're ready to begin inviting your clients. And we can do that right out of the app. We can actually just type in email addresses, go into the address book on our, on our iPad and pull addresses out from there, or even on um, a top producer CRM or 8i account, we can actually send the invites. Out of that Absolutely. System. I think what we're going to see is we're going to see agents really leverage their existing database of home buyers and send out invites to this app because even if the consumer has the app, it's just going to automatically convert that app into what you see on the right hand portion of the screen, which would be in this particular case, the consumer. Now, keep in mind, this could both be could be iPhone to iPhone, could be iPad to iPad right. in the future, could be iPhone or iPad to Android. Right now, the iOS is, is going to be the first release. Right. But now you'll see uh, as a consumer, my app shows Corky Pigman, the realtor that has sent me the link to this app prominently displayed every time every I pull time. up the app. Yeah, and, that, and that's fantastic because, you know, sometimes, once in a while, buyers forget, you know, who they're dealing with. Absolutely. <laughs> and you know what? That's not really the game changer, though, because no. anybody can stick a photo uh, and a contact screen on an app. I think the game changer and, and really what uh, Move is announcing uh, at the Inman conference, uh, patent pending technology, is the ability to communicate with your clients through the mobile app. And that's the amazing part let's let's show them how this works if the uh, if the consumer is searching on their their uh, agent branded RDC app and they're looking at properties there's a lot of things that they can do to engage with their agent absolutely so I'm scrolling through properties here and I come down we're in San Francisco so it's obviously pulling up some San, San Francisco properties nearby here I start looking at this property and now all of a sudden I have some questions about it at the button at the top right there ask my agent will immediately either pull up an email to my agent or I can actually go down here to where it says my agent on the bottom. I could request a showing, I could email the agent, I could call the agent, or I could jump over to the agent's profile right from there. So I could request a showing on this particular property, and within the app, it's gonna send that signal over to your iPad because you're the agent in this particular case. And so whether it's your iPad or your iPhone, we're all familiar with those notifications that mm -hmm. come up when you pull down from the top and so on and so forth. And that's gonna give you uh, a, an, an idea that, hey, you have a customer that has requested some additional information. So under the realtor.com, 
notifications, that's what you see. Yeah, and, and that's the cool part because we can actually have live conversations if we're sending each other messages in real time within the application and it tracks that. So when I go into uh, my clients, connected clients, I can see that, okay, here you are, and it's gonna load the four suggested listings that you had. You requested, so you're, you're quite busy here. You requested seven I wanna showings. see seven properties, please. <laughs> and, and what's great is, here are the seven properties right on my screen. So now we can develop a plan of attack in the order in which we're gonna see these homes. And then of course you have the ability right at the top of the iPad there under the, uh, the little messaging button by the settings to mm -hmm. open up a dialogue. Each one of these properties has its own dialogue. So if we've been talking back and forth about one of these properties, you can actually go to that property. I think I have one or two here that we've had a little dialogue about. Like right there? Yeah, pull that up and it's, hey, I'm asking a question about the property or I requested a showing about the property and you're gonna have a history of our communication about that property which is a really a phenomenal tool so what about um, another agent that had that bought showcase listings you know does their information appear anywhere is that completely removed because on my end, on the iPad here, it still says ask a question, it says Joel, but that doesn't appear on the consumer side, that's only on the agent side. Exactly, uh, if you look, oops, if you look, you actually have the opportunity to not only connect with your agent, but if you continue to scroll down, you're gonna see all the detailed information about the property, and yes, you will see the uh, the, the showcase agent there, but it, you know, from a usability standpoint, it's kinda of like when they drive up to the house, can they still see the sign? Mm -hmm. Can they still see the phone number? Yes, but all of the buttons up near the listing and at the top are all gonna be directed to the to agent you. that you're connected with within the app. Yeah, and I think, that, I think that's fantastic. It's funny that Errol just uh, rang through <laughs> there because he's the one that's gonna be unveiling the app today at Inman exactly he probably wants to talk about it probably <laughs> wants to talk to him and that's my boss so I probably to wrap this up and, <laughs> yeah. and get back to him well I appreciate the time that you took to to and there's our voicemail the time that you took to, to show the app here today this is going to be available for everyone when uh, you, we're looking at putting it into the App Store it's actually been released to the App Store as of today and it usually takes about two weeks so uh, very very soon all right. Well, there you have it. You heard it here first on Tech Savvy Agent, the latest free branded agent application from Realtor.com. I think this is going to change the game. It's going to be huge. We're excited.